MSU students have several different options for getting around campus. Walking, biking, taking the bus, or driving their own cars. But now there's a new option on campus, the Zipcar. We're really excited about having Zipcar on campus because it does round out the suite of transportation options for students, faculty, and staff. And what I mean by that is we have multiple ways to get around campus. People can walk, they can bike, they can take uh, CATA and other forms of uh, transportation, and then they have their own personal vehicle. And what we're really trying to do is minimize people using their own personal vehicle, which has a ton of benefits. There are environmental benefits with less greenhouse gases, lower congestion for traffic. So Zipcar is a nice complement because what people do is they come to campus and then are not stuck. So if they do take public transportation in or they walk or bike, if there's an emergency that comes up or if you have to run to get groceries if you're a student on campus, if you need to run to a doctor's appointment, a Zipcar is available to you pretty easily. It's really just another way of getting around. I consider it kind of your triage method, your emergency ride. Nobody's going to be renting a zip car every single day for the entire time that they're here on campus. However, um, if they're taking something, I see it as a nice compliment. So if you're taking a bus to campus, you've got uh, another form of transportation available to you. Um, there, I think it fills a niche of being able to take quick trips when you need it, when you don't have your own vehicle on campus. And we're hoping what we'll see is um, students and staff or people maybe who are visiting campus who before have paid for a car or purchased a car and then have to pay for a parking pass, insurance, gas, etc. that they feel that it's not, you know, and they only keep it around for just in case purposes. So perhaps now they won't feel like they have to bring a vehicle on campus and they can just use Zipcar for their just in case needs. This is a three-year pilot program and what we're really hoping to see, um, which has been seen at other universities, is that having this option available to people for a car sharing option will help increase our public transit, our more sustainable transit such as biking and walking, and just giving people the peace of mind to use those other types of transportation. So we're hoping to see that reflected in a lot of different uh, data points we are collecting data to see how well this program is going. We would like to, you know, continuously see people embrace the idea of car sharing as a means of rounding out their sustainable transportation modes.